slamming protein shakes, making protein bites, almost injecting protein at this point. These days, protein is one of the most talked about subjects on the internet. However, so much of it is conflicting on what we need. Welcome to the video. My name is Trevor Lomax. I'm a registered dietitian who has worked with hundreds of dudes who want to get more swole than your grandma. The most common advice is one gram of protein per pound of body weight. And this advice is pretty sound in most conditions. And if you've been lifting for less than a year or two, then you might want to check out this video I made about how much protein protein you need to build muscle. But if you're a bigger person, have been lifting for a little longer, are a hard gainer, or just want to know if you're getting enough protein, then let's dig a little bit deeper on this subject. First, we got to realize that protein does so much more than just put on muscle. Building strong bones, supporting an effective immune system, as building blocks for critical hormones, and so much more. Proteins that we eat and proteins that our body makes from the foods that we eat are utilized in almost every process in our body. I like to think of them like Santa's elves, building toys for the boys. And by toys, I mean gains, and by boys, I mean men. Now, we also need to think about protein quality. Each protein has a PDCAAS, or Protein Digestibility Corrected Amino Acid Score. <laughs> well, that's a mouthful. This is essentially how well your body digests and absorbs a protein from a specific food, meaning the protein in a piece of bread is not equivalent to the protein in a piece of juicy steak. And that protein in a steak is made up of a combination of amino acids that is more similar to human muscle. That means that the protein that we consume from a piece of steak is better for building, repairing, and maintaining muscle than the protein is from a slice of bread. One might even say that the steak is the best thing since sliced bread. <laughs> anyway. So let's say you were deep in a bulk and you've been increasing your calories steadily. Maybe you started with one gram of protein per pound of body weight and kept it there, even though you've been increasing your carbohydrates and your fats to provide enough energy to continue making those gains. This means that more and more of that protein goal that you set is coming from those small amounts of protein in grains, breads, cereals, fats, fruits, vegetables, etc. And the protein from those foods are harder to digest and absorb, and the amino acid composition is less similar to human muscle. So this is a perfect example of a time when we would want to increase over that one gram of protein per pound of body weight so that we can get the correct amino acids that our body needs in order to continue building muscle and keep that gains train rolling. So how much more do we want to increase it by? As of now, there's no research telling us how much more we want. So a lot of this is based off of my personal experience and what I've experimented with so far. Personally, I'd start adding about 20 grams of protein each time I increased my calorie goal. So if my bulk started off at 3000 calories and I moved it up to 3300 calories, then I would wanna increase my protein about 20 grams. If everything I said in this video makes you nervous and you wanna increase it more, I'm not saying there's no evidence to refute that. And conversely, if it's too hard to increase 20 grams of protein because of how full it will make you feel, then going up maybe five or 10 grams may be a better solution in your specific scenario. Like I said, I haven't seen any evidence supporting how much to increase in this specific scenario, but increasing it by some amount is gonna do you more good than not increasing it at all. And when we're speaking of increasing calories, if you struggle with knowing when to increase your calories in a bulk, then check out this video I released last week about when to increase your calories in a bulk and how to be confident in that decision. Subscribe for more gains and destroy that like button because you are a beast. Thank you for watching. See you soon.